Fox 24 News, we got to look at your top trend. This is Kirika Azuka joining us in studio. Yes, hello, oh, hello. Always a pleasure to have you. Good morning. Guys, yeah. tis the season, it and is. the White House is all decked out for the holidays. Oh. First Lady Melania Trump tweeted out this video showing off decorations inside the executive mansion. Take a look. This year's theme is the oh. spirit of America. It's a simple oh, white color dream. scheme. One ornament made of Scrabble pieces spells out be best. Mrs. Trump says she's excited for everyone to experience wow. the beauty of the Christmas season. Wow. That is beautiful. That is. That is gorgeous. I love that. I'm the boring person on Christmas. I like themes like one color, yes. solid yeah. color. So this is my yeah. aesthetic 100%. Yeah, I agree. That is beautiful. What a walk. Them, all the white lights and just glowing. Yes. It's cool. Pretty cool stuff. Some of those yeah. decorations on one of those trees, I'm not sure which one, but uh, regionally, some kids in Neosha, Missouri made some decorations that went to the White House. Oh, nice. So pretty cool stuff. I which learned that did. last week, actually. Where um, Americans can have a, you know, a party. Yeah, part yeah. of it. Yeah. Absolutely. I love it. That's so cool. Yeah. yeah. So a dying Star Wars fan received one of his final wishes. The patient wanted to watch the newest movie in the franchise Star Wars, The Rise of Skywalker. The problem is the film hasn't been released yet, so it's difficult to get a film out. And it won't be in theaters until mid-December. Mm -hmm. uh, oh. So on Tuesday, Rowan's Hospice in Hampshire, England, uh, where the patient is being treated, took to Twitter to make the plea on the patient's behalf saying time is not on his side. Mm. The appeal met with a strong support, including uh, Mark Hamill, of course, uh, Luke Skywalker. Wow. Uh, so Aww. wishing him uh, the hospice good luck on his request. And we understand that uh, Disney's chairman and CEO Bob Iger says he's going to make it happen. So Gosh, he I stepped in and said, we're going to be able to do this. So. I love stories like this, yeah. first of all. It just shows that it's not all about the money because this kid, you know, this is something clearly a big, big dream for him. And, yeah. you know, Star, they, they can they can spare it. Yeah. That's that's a beautiful story. To make it all come true. It I is. love it. Oh, yeah. yeah, that's so cool. So going along with the holiday season theme, uh -huh. it's a great start for the Beehive, which I am a proud member of. <laughs> As singer songwriter Beyonce releases a new collection, the 2019 Shop Beyonce Holiday Line. Now it includes gift items from clothing, accessories, plus holiday specific merchandise like mm -hmm. ornaments and wrapping paper. Now this isn't the first time Beyonce has released a mini collection. In February 2018, she also released a limited edition line with a Valentine. Day theme. Pretty cool. So I see where all my money is going. Beyonce you go. is not even a trifecta. What she sings, dance, acts, and now she's a brand merchandising entrepreneur or whatever else. And I mean, that's my big sister. So like, I am, I'm very proud of everything <laughs> that she is doing. Like she's like she's an entrepreneur. She's a mom. She's wife. She's killing the game. And yeah. I'm so proud. And I see where all my money. Uh, everyone in my family on my Christmas list, you are gonna get something from Beyonce's line. You heard it here first. From Just Interior. so you know. Yeah. <laughs> All right, uh, sounds from underwater speakers may be the key to helping revive the world's coral reefs. Oh, cool. A recent study published in the journal Nature Communications shows that uh, how a little bit of noise wasn't enough to bring life back to a dying coral. Mm -hmm. Researchers found playing a recording from healthy coral reefs near ailing ones brought double the amount of fish and increased the number of marine species by 50%. Overall, uh, bringing fish back to the unhealthy coral which will help clean it up and create space for new coral to grow. Scientists say although uh, this successful study will not solve the issue of dying coral reefs around the world, it's a step in the right direction. So nice. I didn't realize that uh, coral reefs made a lot of noise, but the noise attracts fish, which helps build the coral. That's wow. so cool. Yeah. And random. Familiar sounds. And I think humans yeah. are like that, too. I know you can play a song from any given decade, or I'm sure there's a song you might have heard when you were a kid, and you remember where you were at that place in that time. Right. This true. is pretty neat. It's well, pretty if cool. I hear noise like the neighbors having a party, uh -huh. I go down and see what's happening. <laughs> and I'm sure the fish are doing the same. <laughs> They're just, hey, what's going on over there? Saving going? the world. That's amazing. <laughs> I love that. I love that. Yeah. Rick, you've got to look at our forecast coming up. Yeah. We saw some wind yesterday. No. I was in hibernation. Yeah. I might do the same today. <laughs> same. Yeah. I've lost a few more hair from the wind <laughs> yesterday. It was like blowing. Too much. But anyway, it'll calm down. Uh, better weather on the way for the next several days. The forecast up next.